Hi everyone, George Farmer here, and I am in a river. Exciting. Hi everyone, uh, George here. We've got this gentleman with me here. For those that don't know, Shrimp King himself, Chris Luke out. I crown myself, guys. I'm going to crown myself the Skate King. You are the Skate King. I just wanted to tell you, you are the Skate King and I am the Shrimp King. There we go. And, yeah, <laughs> just tell, tell everyone where we're going and what we're doing, Chris. Well, we're, we're in Florida now. We're just leaving Orlando. We're going like heading west, northwest. The place is called Rainbow River Springs and it's a beautiful place. It's a spring, very clear water. Uh, we will probably see alligators. Yeah. I will, we will go two people there. I probably return are we, alone. Are we going to die? <laughs> <laughs> we will rent a boat, go out and have some filming yeah. and see if we can uh, have some nice water plants. Perfect. Turtles. Awesome. All the wildlife. I'm excited. <clears throat> Me too. So here we are at Rainbow River. Uh, we're going to try and find the guy in charge, so uh, get some permission to film, etc. But uh, quite a popular destination for tourists, etc., for kayaking. But hopefully, it's not going to be too busy today. Uh, it's actually not that hot, believe it or not. It looks super sunny. It is super sunny, but it's probably it's like 16, 17 degrees. Yeah, Celsius. 16, 17. Feels warmer in the sun. Super excited to go and discover some. Underwater plants, alligators, turtles. Alligators fish. sounds safe. <laughs> Good that there's no crocodiles. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, so yeah, really excited, and obviously we're going to share the journey with you. So don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, guys, if you do enjoy the content, and subscribe if you haven't already. Me and Chris are actually on the river right now and we can see some beautiful aquatic plants already. The water is so clear. There's a little bit of algae, but it's not too bad. I mean, I think I can see some Ludwigia by the look of it, this red plant just ahead. Okay, so I've got my iPhone. It's supposed to be waterproof. So So let's see. Check it out now. I'm just going to try and lie flat so we don't rock the boat too much. There we go. Yeah, it's awesome. Look at that, Chris. Can you see the picture? Yes, yes. Beautiful. So I'm not sure if you can hear me, guys. I've got the microphone plugged in, but hopefully you can still pick up 
what I'm talking about. It looks like Valisneria, is it, Americana? Yeah, oh, That's uh, Sagittaria, is it? Yeah, yeah. Do we have Valis here as well? Valisneria? Yeah. Yeah, probably Americana. That's, um, what are the, is that hydrocotyle? Looks like, right, like a monster, Hydrocotyle, yeah. Yeah. Uh, beautiful. Some big fish over there. Let me see if I can get more close. This is a restricted area. In fact, we are just at the at the border. But this is a, a beautiful plant here. Look at this, guys. This is proper nature aquarium, for real. Got to give my super thanks to Chris for inviting me along to this trip. It's uh, so cool to be amongst the nature like this. Yeah, so this kind of bright green round leaf plant looks like hydrocotyle. Maybe it's, it looks like a giant verticillata. Really, be, really beautiful. Hopefully, we can see some fish as well at some point soon. So next, we're going to paddle upstream about a mile or so, and then we can actually go into jump into the water and get some proper footage for you. But just check out. Paradise. This is like paradise, isn't it? Look at it. Absolutely stunning. I love my job sometimes so much. Okay, so I'm going to go snorkeling. Hopefully we can see some fish and some cool plants. Let's go. Okay, so uh, here I am in the river with Chris. <laughs> uh, we've done loads of, loads of diving. Chris has been shooting with his huge camera. Let's have a look. So what you got there, Chris? Mark Canon 5D Mark II and some epic underwater housing. This is the BS Kinetics housing and for my 5D Mark II, because with this one, you can take really good pictures and it's very stable, you know, when you when you want to shoot, you don't shake too much. I mean, with the new programs, of course, you can all. Yeah. Uh, but I really love this uh, this way and you can see the difference. What have we seen today? We've seen killifish. We've seen um, uh, lipomis, which is a bass, a yeah. sunfish. Then we have seen killifish. We have seen turtles. Yeah. And I was hoping for gar, so maybe we can go to a place. I, I thought maybe here, but... Uh, Probably it's too much traffic on the, on the... Thankfully no alligators. Well, probably also, but you don't see them. It's probably over there or somewhere hiding. <laughs> Hopefully okay. no big ones. Ludwigia repens. It is 
just really nice to be able to see it for real, how it grows in the wild. And yeah, it's just quite crazy for me. Someone that lives in the UK that sees very few aquatic plants, even fewer that you can actually grow successfully in a long-term planted aquarium. And then to be able to get treated to something like this, beautiful red, almost algae-free, it's a relatively common aquarium plant, but it's just something really special about seeing it growing in nature. So, it's a real treat for me. There we go guys, a brief insight into what you can experience in the waters of Florida, the Rainbow River. I think the most impressive for me was the, uh, the clear water, and this is a product of the, the springs, so it's constantly kind of, it's, it's almost like an infinite Millions water change. Millions of gallons coming out yeah, like a constant every water change. second. Yeah. Yeah. And, and Chris noticed, he's been a few times, and he noticed more algae, algae growth this year. I've seen a lot of algae. I've never seen that many algae in, in the um, in the run because the the spring itself was okay, but yeah, after it, two maybe one two miles you could see the algae. Yeah. Yeah. So I think that's because of the if you look around, there's a lot of farmers here, mm. and I think that is the reason. So like uh, fertilizer, like fertilizer runoff, yeah. so more nutrients I, in the water, yeah. not enough plants to deal with those nutrients. Yes. So yeah, okay. I was a bit disappointed. <coughs> But anyway, we had we had fun, right? Yeah, great fun. <laughs> Chris made me continually kind of jump in the water and do some crazy swimming moves for the the video that he's gonna release at some point. Um, so yeah, I, hope, I really hope you enjoyed it, guys. I loved it. It's been the highlight of my American trip so far. So I have to say thanks so much to Chris for inviting me along. You're welcome. Really appreciate it. If you don't know who Chris is, he is known as the Shrimp King. You can find him on Facebook. Uh, search for Chris Luke Cowpaw Shrimp King. And also he has a very fast growing Instagram channel called Chris Luke Help, all one word, lowercase. I think so. Yeah, it is. Yeah. I'm not posting every day guys, I'm a bit lazy, you know, Should so do. one time a week. He's an amazing photographer, so check out his material, absolutely fantastic, really inspirational guy as well. Fun fact, he used to be in a German heavy metal band. Very heavy metal, yeah. But here we listen to country, right? We have to, li we have just country music. <laughs> <here. laughs> yeah. You always want to listen to pop music, but country, I can't. Actually, I'm a, I'm a drum and bass fan, secretly. A who? Drum and bass. Drum and bass. Drum and bass. And where's the guitar then? No guitar. It's no all electronic, guitar? yeah. Oh, I like handmade music. So. I, to, I, like, I like to run to that. Yes. Okay, we're, we're digressing. So, I hope you enjoyed the vlog. Uh, uh, like I said, really, really cool. You, hopefully some great underwater footage for you to enjoy as well and I filmed it all on my iPhone and I think that's fantastic and what a great device so really pleased about that okay okay, okay you guys uh, thanks for watching as always uh, drop us a comment below what was your favorite part of the vlog uh, mine was probably we were searching out like the best Ludwig gear that we could find I really enjoyed Pretty that red and amazing let me know in the comments always read all your comments always really appreciate it Take care. Keep on escaping. Cheerio.